Hey everyone, this is Vincent Wynn for Slash Gear, and this is Windows Phone 7 on Samsung hardware. And I'm going to unbox it for you right this minute. So here it is. I'm going to take it out of the packaging. This particular device made by Samsung has a frequency for AT&T, so I'll be able to get 3G on it. Um, it will work with T-Mobile SIM since it is an unlocked international phone. I'm trying to figure out how to put the SIM card in here. Give me a second here. Ah, finally. There's got to be a battery in here somewhere, right? Oh, there it is. And that is, by the way, a 5 megapixel camera and an LED flash. So I'm going to put the back cover on. Come on. I know you can get in there. All right, let's give it a try one more time. See if I can get that back cover on. Good luck trying to get this thing out once it's on, by the way. And there it is, finally got the back cover on. On the right hand side is the micro USB uh, slot for charging and syncing. And that's a dedicated camera button on the right hand side and that is the power button on the top right uh, this is for I believe the three and a half millimeter head phone jack on the left hand side is the volume rocker the bottom left I believe is the memory um, card slot and that was the boot up screen by the way that we just missed Let me see what kind of memory card comes with this phone. It doesn't come out. It should usually just spring out pretty easily. Oh, and by the way, welcome to your Samsung Taylor Windows Phone boot up screen. And we're going to go ahead and select English. Accept. And this does ask me to either go with recommendation, the recommended setting, or customize. I think I'm going to go with recommended. Set, um, central time zone. And done. You're then presented with a set of default live tiles. Phone. People, email, messages, calendar, browser, Xbox Live, images, Zoom, marketplace. And if you pan over to the left, you're presented with a set of apps and menus. At the bottom, there are three buttons. The middle is your home button, back, and search. Is on the right hand side and it does use Bing by default so let's go ahead and see what else is included in the box charging cable and a headset that's it for this unboxing of Windows Phone 7 Make sure to check SlashGear.com for my full review of Windows Phone 7 technical review. Thanks for watching.